MTN Sports Grace Lawrence here at Gallatin High for a much better day of weather for the second and final day of Eastern Double A Divisionals for track and field. Let's see how these athletes fare as they gear up for state next week in Great Falls. The running event started off with 110 meter hurdles and it's the future Bobcat taking the gold once again. Gallatin's Nash Coley with a pretty sizable lead to finish this one with a time of 14.77 seconds. Over on the girls' side, it comes down to the wire, and Scarlett Harris of Great Falls gets the win with a time of 15.14 seconds. It's the 400-meter dash. Gallatin's Isabel Ross adding another first-place finish to the win column. She finished in 59.09 seconds. For the boys, it's CMR's Jackson Tarver crossing the finish line first with a time of 48.87 seconds. She won the shot put yesterday and the discus today. Idaho signee Tessie Camps of Gallatin with the winning throw of 126 feet and 10 inches. Over to the 1600, starting off with the girls, it's a tight race between the Hawk, Kylie Neal, and the Raptor, Claire Rutherford. But Neal closes in this last stretch to grab the win in just under 5 minutes and 9 seconds. Over to the boys, he's one of the top high school distance runners in the nation. Her brother, Nathan Neal, really showing out in this event. He'll finish first the stellar time of 4 minutes and 6 seconds. You know the drill, it always ends with a 4x4 relay and it's all Raptors. But West and Bozeman are right on Gallatin's heels for the girls' event. But Ross, who's anchoring, brings it home with a winning time of 4 minutes, 4 seconds. Over on the boys' side, it's Gallatin out to the early lead. And the anchor here, Oscar Patterson, really putting on those wheels to grab the meet record of 3 minutes and 20.7 seconds. Both the Raptors girls and boys programs took home the team wins. In Bozeman, Grace Lawrence, MTN Sports.